welcome to Saturdays with Lee. And this week I'll be showing you how to do Hufflepuff house colour nails. Now for this tutorial I'm going to be using the yellow and black colours. Right, so the nails I'm going to be doing <laughs> are these. Some little finger, stripes, and then it's kind of a diamond one. This is the nail crackling polish in the colours, and this has got glitter on. And then the last one, it's the hardest one to do, it's kind of like a grid shape. So I'll be showing you how to do all of them. Now earlier I prepared some, so they're dry. So for this you'll need to use Black nail polish. This is Barry M. They're all Barry M because it's my favourite type. And a yellow one. And a black nail crackling one. Okay. So, first of all, I will show you how to do this nail. Right, you need to get some cellar tape. And you want to be putting it about halfway. I will just do this. And you need to make sure that it's pressed down hard enough, otherwise, the nail colour will come underneath and it's really annoying. Okay. doesn't matter if you go around the edge, you can sort it out later. And I've got this rapid dry for nails, I found out that I got it from Tesco but you can get it from many other places, it's really useful. Right, the next one I'm going to be doing is the diamond one. Now you need to do this in two stages. So again, get some cellar tape. And this time, you can decide where you want the diamonds, but you put it over the main part of the nail. Press down firmly again. Don't want it to go wrong. And get your black again. This paint over. Sort out the bits around the edge again. But it doesn't matter if you've got these left at the end, you can always get it off a nail varnish remover. And then make that dry. You can just do this, remember, by using the hair dry if you don't have the product. So while we're waiting for that, the next one we'll do is the nail crackling one. Now this is really hard to use. You need to only do one coat, because if you do more than that, it will come lumpy. So, make sure there's enough on there. And do not go over bits again. And then you should wait and it will start to crackle. Doesn't matter if there's bits like that left over, it adds to the effect. Now, we're going to be doing the glittery nail. So you need to start off by doing black nail polish. And you should use gold glitter to make sure it Hufflepuff colours. Quickly go on the edge, but don't take too long doing this. Because you need to put the glitter on before it dries. So you take some glitter and then just lightly sprinkle it on as much or as little as you want. And now I've done that, to make sure it stays on there I can use this. And now this one, it takes quite a long time so you need two pieces of tape again for this 
first one, just do it along the bottom. You need to choose a corner that you want to use, so I'm doing this one. And now I need a piece of cello tape down here. Press down enough. Okay, so this will be black. Right, now I need to see if this one is done. It might be. So you want to put it up like this. And there you go. You have a nice straight line. If it's not straight, you can always go over it again. It doesn't matter. So now, I will see if this one's done. Another nice straight line, but you want to make sure it's dry before you next put the next piece of cello tape on, because otherwise that will be a disaster. So the next one will be going along here. So that is done. The glitter is done, and we're just waiting for this one. Just waiting for it to dry. This is a live video. <laughs> See, it's gone a bit over there, but I can always sort that out later. Right, now I'm going to be needing two more bits of sellotape, but I might want to leave that to make sure it's really dry before I put the next ones on. So I'll go back to this now. And then you want it to line up. Press it down again. And then now the black. And then go on the edge. Get it ready for drying. So there you go. There is how to do an odd collection of Hufflepuff nails. You can do any design you want, or you can just mix and match like I've done, or stay one of kind. So glitter, crackling, diamond, 
classic striped ones. And then these odd ones look a bit like nuclear waste. 